I'm going to put a label onto a window, lots of text on it, wrap it around, justify it, change the colors, change the font, put a picture on the label too, and shift them both around a bit. So, let's get started. First thing I'll do is, from T. Kinter, I'm going to import star. And then, also from T. Kinter, I'm going to import T. T. Gay. I'm going to make a root window and call the constructor. And we're done. Now, uh, where is he? There he is. Okay, I'll move him down here a bit and call him up whenever something should appear on the uh, window. Uh, next, what should we do? Ah, let's make the label. So I'll call the label L. L equals the following. TTK, yeah, call your label method. Tell him I want something on the root window. A uh, label on the root window. And the text on it should say China. That sounds interesting. And close friends. And nothing will appear on the on the window yet. As you can see, till I pack it in. And move that up there. And have to key in L dot pack open close friends. And then then he he does have something popping up there. There it is. Whoops. There's China on it now. Alright, let me move him out of the way. And I'll call him as I as as is as is needed. I packed it in. Now I want to change it. I'm gonna say L, yes. Should you configure yourself so that the text on you now says uh Tibet. Oops, not Tibet, Tibet. There we go. And as you may have expected, there it is, Tibet. Okay, now next, uh, let's, uh, let's put a lot of text on there now. Let's uh, quote Genghis Khan here. L dot config. L configure yourself so that the text now says, um, the, Without the vision of a goal, a man cannot manage his own life. Yeah. And now I've got that. Here. Oh, it doesn't look good. I can't see everything. So, what do I do? I say L, yes, configure your silly self so that your wraparound length equals 100. And voila. Take a look, say, that is good now. Maybe a little bit bigger, but without the vision of a goal, a man cannot manage his own life. It's a nice Genghis Khan quote. And, uh, that was nice. And center it, of course, that would be, that would be fun. So, L dot, configure it, configure yourself, so that, you well, know, you justify yourself. A la center. And this time, this guy is centered. A 
All right. The next thing I want to do is let's look at this guy. It's what if I made the foreground on this guy red and the background black? That would look uh, cool. Let's try that. Uh, Mr. L, yes, configure yourself so that your foreground equals red, comma, and your background equals black. And, oh, la wow, wow, look at what we got. Uh, it's a little bit difficult to see. Maybe if I made the foreground white. All right, let's try that. We're going to make the foreground white. And the background is black. Hit enter. And that is easier to see. But it's not bold, and I don't like the uh, font style. So let's change that. Mr. L, I want you to configure yourself so that your font equals the following. Open, close, friends. Uh, Arial. I want it to be Arial. 18 points. And bold. And voila, mes enfants. We now have ourselves something that's big, bad, and bold. <laughs> Maybe we should make it a little bit bigger. Maybe like 200. That might be too wide. Let's go for 125. Alright. Let's change that to 125. 125. The wrap length. And... Eh, it's a little bit better. Whoa. Where did you go? Oh, there you are. That's better. All right, now, well, that was uh, 18 points, still a little bit big. Let's make it 14 points. So I click up here, hit enter, and I'll just change 18 to 14. And as you can see, it has changed. Okay, that's good. I'm going to leave it big like that. You'll see why in a moment. But... I want to put something small on there. So L, configure yourself so that your text now says something really super duper simple. Hi. That's all. And that's, that's it. Well, now I'm going to put a photo on there. I'm going to call the, uh, call it my picture, my picture equals photo image, and the file is equal to the following. It's on the E drive, colon, slash slash, backslash, backslash. Uh, it's in my logarithms directory. And the name is Gary New 5 dot gif. Whoops. G-I-F, close quotes, close params, on our rhythms. Let's see if my spelling is okay. It is. So I put that into a variable called my picture. And now I'm going to tell the system, or tell L, just a label, to configure yourself. It says how? Well, you know, I want you to have an, the image you're going to use is going to be what I just put into MP. And uh, bingo. It just worked. Uh, it's 
this uh, this handsome movie star has now appeared on my uh, on my label. Who just happens to look like me? <laughs> okay, that was bad. Uh, next, uh, I've configured this now so that the image is from this variable MP over here. So the image I want you to use, you'll find it in the variable MP. What's an MP? This file. All right. Now, now what do I do? Uh, let's play around with this now and see what happens. Move it out of the way for a second. Now, I'm going to say L. I'm tired of Mr. L. I'm tired of seeing that picture of mine. I want you to configure yourself again, and so that uh, you know, let's use compound because you can do one of two things: compound equals text. I don't want you to have that picture on there anymore. I want you to have just text. When I hit enter, my picture which is right here, is going to disappear and is going to get replaced with high. Here we go. And it's gone now. High has taken its place. Well, I want my picture back. So I key in l.config compound equals image. In quotes. Now watch what happens when I hit enter. Bam. Image comes back on. Or well, what if I want to see both? That would be very nice. So, what would I key in? I key in the word center. C-E-N-T-E-R. Now, right now, I've got my picture up here. When I click on center, the text is going to appear on top of this. All right, here we go. And voila, there it is. Hi. Hmm. Now, what if I want to uh, put the picture so that it's to the, uh, I don't know, to the left of this word high? What would I do? I wouldn't want it centered. I would want it on the left. So let's key left. And we hit enter. And now my picture is to the left of the text. Well, what do you think I should key in if I wanted my picture to be to the right of that text? Hmm. Sounds like a tough problem. Here we go. I'm going to key in. L config compound equals right. And hit enter. And bada bing, bada bang, bada boom, it works. Just like that. So here we're able to put a label and a picture onto uh, some text and a, and a picture onto a label. And, uh, and then position them both so that they're uh, to the left and right of each other. That's pretty good. Okie dokie. That's all I have to say for now. This is George Ball. Thanks for listening. And if you enjoyed the uh, video, please rate it by clicking on the uh, like button. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.